In this tutorial, we will be using the Split Geometry tool to split large objects into smaller, more manageable segments. To access the Split Geometry feature, select the object you wish to split. In the Element Properties window, click the Split Geometry button. The Geometry Splitting interface will appear. You can navigate inside this interface as you would in Free Camera. To split your object, click the Split button to the right of the display color to bring up your split plane. Move the mouse cursor over your surface to view your proposed split in real time. Please note that Fuser actively calculates your new split volumes. To rotate your split plane along the vertical axis, hold the Shift key and move your mouse to the left and right. To rotate your split plane along the horizontal axis, hold the Control key and move your mouse to the left and right. Once you're satisfied with the location of your split, click on your object to split your geometry. Geometry can be split multiple times. Simply click the Split button next to the section you wish to split and repeat the previous steps. To reset your splits back to the initial state, click the Reset button. To accept your new splits, click Finish, or click Cancel to exit the Geometry Splitting interface without making any changes. Please note that once your split is accepted, your geometry can only be reconnected by resynchronizing with your authoring software or merging an unsplit version. Your newly split geometry is now ready to be assigned to your schedule. Simply click on your newly split sections and add them to your selected tasks. 